Hello, everybody. Hello, my name is Paul. Welcome, one and all. So here we are in Bordex Castle. End game. We've finished Sirenia, the mountains, the Yeti, the everything, the owl, and the things. And actually, that's a really nice point. The owl, is, Cedric, is no longer with us. He's not dead, though I wish he kind of was. But he's uh, he's hanging around outside, just hanging back like the owls do. That the owls does, the owls do. Yeah, I'm off to a great start. Let's go. <laughs> Let's finish this game up. All right. Oh, ugh. Ah, 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 this, oh, oh, his eyes still follow me. This is even more unsettling. Oh, hi. I Goodbye, King Graham of Daventry. But what's going on? Oh, my God. Oh, God, you vaporized me. Poor Graham Modoc shows no mercy. Oh, boy. And the last time I saved was back here. This is a good way to start. All right, that took forever. Let's try this again. So you remember in the original King's Quest, there was a little thing up there that followed you. Oh, but you're not supposed to find me yet. Um, I can't make it out of this room. All right, well, go ahead and take me. There we go. Hold me up rigid rigor mortis style and throw. There we go. Beautiful. All right. Oh, and there goes the mouse into the rat hole. Okay, good. Calling my attention to it like I missed. Oh, those many moons ago. Let's see if we can actually look inside it. Let's see if it has a graphic for the cheese on the ground. Probably not. Probably just going to say, hey, there's cheese in there. What do you know? Graham can see a small moldy piece of cheese just inside the mouse hole. Wait, what? Oh, hey, Cosima. Hello. What? Where did you come from? From the labyrinth. I spend a lot of time down here, you know, with my friends, the mice. Friends? Yes, like Dink and Sam. I don't think you ever met Sam or not. Anyway, I found this loose stone once and it led here to this cell. Now, come on. You'd better get out of here. Hello. Okay. One minute. I gotta get. I have to use a fish hook on a mouse hole. Don't ask any questions about it. Just trust me on this one. <laughs> Graham wiggles on the ground like a baby for a few seconds and somehow gets a piece of cheese out of the idea. All right, let's see if we can follow her back. Um, where is she? Oh, there she is. Oh, God. I, for a second, I thought she was forsaken me. Kasima? Kasima? Oh. How did you, did you just phase through the door, or were you the door the entire time? All right, well, whatever. Missing animations notwithstanding, we survived. And actually, thankfully, not that far from the door. Love it. Saving here, good, and we don't have to worry about that ever, ever again, I hope. So I haven't even made it a single room into Mordax Castle without getting busted by either him or the blue guard. Oh, and speaking of, I'm going to get the peas ready to go, because the peas are the way... What the hell is that? Oh, that's the cheese. Oh, that... Okay, yeah, once I use my imagination, I can kind of see that that is indeed the... Three quarters of a cheese wheel. Right. Oh, there's the cat. Jesus. Actually, that's that's actually a pretty good opportunity to get the cat. Can I talk to the kitty? Like I could before? You. How did you get here? I have journeyed far over land and sea. Never mind. Your journey is now over. Wow, that was fast. Goodbye, King Graham of Daventry. And fizzle, fizzle, and die. All right, I can do this. And there's the kitty cat. All right, so we're not even going to talk to him. We're just going to feed him the fish, which should lead us down the path of righteousness and fish. There you go, kitty. And normally, I would say bang his head in with the cobbler's hammer, but the bet. Oh, I can't yet because I haven't emptied out the pea bag yet. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, almighty. All right. Okay, good. No cat, but there is the, the monster. Okay, here you go. Look, you can see that line of text below the uh, the inventory bar now. What is that? I guess maybe it's kind of like spare room that the developers use for something. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Anyway, peas for you. Maybe you're Sam. Are you Sam? Bloop. Oh. What? That was your slipping animation? I could have, God, I did animation like that better in, like, elementary school. Nintendo, you jerks. I can't play the organ? Why would you not make that an option? Why is it even there? Oh, hi. 
All right, the dining room actually looks pretty good. I like that. Here is the kitty. This is great and all, but I need to find that cat. There he is. Okay. Come on. It looks like he's just like banging his head against the floor like a woodpecker. There you go. Cat's in the bag. So at least now we can officially say that the pouch is no longer empty. It was only empty for about a second anyway. Oh, I keep forgetting. They combined these two rooms. And that's fine. Whatever. All right, upsy upsy. There we go. Oh, God. No, 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 no. Oh, come on, man. Oh, for crying out loud. I got to do all that again. All right, cat's back in the bag. Let's try and do this without getting cornered by Mordak immediately. All right, so there's the lab in there. We don't want to go in there. We want to go in here and get to the library. Ugh. Ugh. How can you even tell what that's supposed to be if you don't know what it was before? That's awful. All right, uh, where's the book? This must be it here. Guess using my eyes on it should be enough, right? Can we learn some magic spells? A large book lying upon the corner desk attracts Graham's curiosity. All right, so I guess the eye is not enough. Hands it is. Put my hands all over it. Fingerprint evidence. Ahoy. Well, that's actually not a bad rendering of the original drawings. Hmm, this looks interesting. Graham wonders what the symbols mean. I guess I've committed them to memory. All right, so let's wait here until Mordak goes to bed. There he goes. That didn't take that long. Oh, God, his skin is as gray as a vampire. All right, so he's gently sleeping. So I'm gently going to go over there and steal everything that shines. Sorry, hope that ding didn't wake you up, Mordak. So now we're going into the laboratory and we're never leaving again. It's the last room we'll ever see. And, oh, what? What? And apparently, this looks like a balcony in the void somewhere. Let's take a look at our bottle, our family. Let's see if he does anything. Tears comes to Graham's eyes as he sees his beloved family in castle held captive inside the large glass bottle. But we're not concerned with it just yet. Actually, can I interact with it anyway? Probably not. Looking at his frantically waving family inside their glass prison makes Graham's heart break as he realizes his inability to save them from their current predicament. All right, up we go, up we go. Let's let's do it. We know the solution. Oh wow, that's a lot pinker than I was expecting. And what's with that awful humming sound? It's actually not that bad looking. I gotta say, with all the chains and the yokes and the and the pendulums and everything, it's not bad. Not bad at all. Okay. All right, so let's set up the wands. This will take an hour. What? Oh, come on. Can you even do that? It took me forever to put these wands on the table, Mordak. You son of a bitch. And by the way, you don't have your wand. You shouldn't be able to do that. Ouch. Ugh. All right, Mordak. I can do this as long as you can. I swear the developers of this game, this port, made it harder than it has to be. Why would they include... Well, okay. It was an honest port for a while. But why would they, A... Make the, uh, the, what was it, the, the dungeon was so much longer and more complicated than it was before. And B, what, Mordak is, like, impossible. He appears everywhere, even when he's, like, asleep. Just skip all this. It's just me whining. All right. It's time to start the machine with the, with the cheese. Yeah, let's just do it. I'm not even gonna, let's, let's not even belabor it. Let's throw the cheese in the machine because that's what you do. Go ahead and let's watch this animation. I can't wait. Graham tosses the moldy cheese into the machine's bubbling liquid. Still never understood this. Never got the logic behind it at all. Oh, so in this one you can actually see the actual transference of power. Oh, that's kind of nifty. So it sucks it up out of one. You can see the lightning bolt kind of move from one side and down and zippy zip zip. Alright, that's actually kind of a nice little touch. It still looks like crap, but it's a nice touch. Oh my god, how much how much longer do we have to see this? This has been going on for a minute now. Thank you. I still can't move, but are you done? Ugh, Mordok's wand barely glows. Perhaps its power has weakened, while Crispin's old wand now appears completely energized. 
Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh, that's infuriating. I'm sorry. I usually don't lose my temper, but what's even worse is that I, I save stated right there. So as soon as I restore, Mordak appears. I was able to kind of freeze the game with the select menu and grab the wand really quick before Mordak appeared. But, oh, that would have made me so mad. I would have to restart the entire game. What's going on here? I'll take care of you, you swine. No, you're not. Graham, great news. I've heard from Crispin. <laughs> <laughs> what the? That's amazing. What have you done to my wand? Think you can outwit me, little man? Ha! Let me show you a thing or two. And what are you gonna? What are you, you little Cthulhu esque monster, you? Okay. I don't have time to do anything. I couldn't do anything. Stop. Stop humping my face. Knock it off. Okay, let's see if I can sneak in there again. Okay, we got it. Oh, nope. Missed it. Ugh, just to show you how tight that actually was. I have about a fento second to select the hand and get the wand before Mordak appears and roasts my bones. Okay, so now we can take care of the bat scorpion uh, thing I guess just by using the wand and then that menu should appear and the lack of music is really not doing any favors to it okay let's see for the that thing oh I forgot what I use uh, the tiger I think the mongoose the rabbit yeah it's the tiger ah uh, you're the tiger oh there's some music there we go I will get you you I don't even know what you are you look like some sort of arachnid spider bat why, you little... Okay, well, nothing the music then. All right, dragon. Oh, he looks just like the dragon outside. Oh, no, oh, really? Really? You're going to give me that much time to do anything? I didn't make a move at all, you jerk. All right, well, let's do this again. All right, here we go. All right, so dragon, and I have like a, a nanosecond. There we go. Wand selected on you. Excellent, okay. Oh, thank God I learned that that select menu trick, because otherwise I would I would be doomed. All right, so let's do the the rabbit trick. Let's do it. Can't get me. Ah, uh, there we go. But you're very slow motion. Can't get me. I'm a rabbit. All right, we get it. We get it. I'm, I'm very fast, and you shoot fire. There we go. You think you're so smart, don't you? Well, I've got you now. All right, there's the snake. I can't do anything yet. Gotta wait for him to get closer. Say goodbye, swine. Wand on you, and then we go all ricky-ticky-tabby on this biatch. Very slowly, and then just like kind of go up and like lick his face like a dog. So if this is the way you want to play. All right, and there we go, fire snake. Very quickly, because I'm going to incinerate if I don't. And the last thing I can do is the rain cloud. Last piece of interactive medium in this entire game. Oh, and thank God for that. Let's watch the epilogue, shall we? Yes. No triumphant music, no nothing. That's just the way it is. He's dead. Now why won't you work? It didn't work the first time, Graham. Oh, hey, Kasima. Welcome. Oh, Princess Kasima. Well, I did it. Mordak is gone. Gone? Are you sure? Maybe he's only trying to trick you. He's gone, all right. He turned himself into a fire and I put him out with rainwater. He'll never bother anyone else ever again. But now I have a bigger problem. I don't know what to do about my family or my castle. I don't know how to turn them back to normal. After all you've been through, there must be a way. Enter Crispin, there you are. Hey, I have the solution to all your problems, Graham. 
While you and Cedric were gone, I did some asking around, and I found out that your son, Alexander, had the dubious distinction, if you may, of turning Mordak's brother Manannan into a cat some time back. Such an awkward sentence. Way too many commas. Obviously, this deed angered Mordak, who could do nothing about it since this particular spell could only be undone by the actual perpetrator, your son. It doesn't take a great genius to find out that Mordak took your family and castle in revenge to try to persuade Alexander to restore Manannan back to his old self. Oh god, I did discover, and now I see, that your castle and family were miniaturized and imprisoned inside a glass bottle. I did the research and found the spell for turning everything back to normal. Now watch. Hocus. Pocus. Aliosius. Aw, oh, yay. Oh, nice shirt, Alexander. Valenice, my children, my joy knows no limits. Good, go to your wife first. That's the smart thing to do. Alexander, I'm going to punch you right in the face. Rosella, I'm going to stand in front of you as well. Oh, Daddy, I'm so glad you're here. I imagine that's how she talks. Oh, Princess Cosima, how could I forget you? Let me introduce you to my family. This is my wife, Queen Valenice, my daughter, Princess Rosella, and my son, Prince Alexander, who started this whole mess. All of you, this is Princess Cosima from the Land of the Green Isles. Without her, none of us would be standing here now. Bravely, she's... She bravely saved my life. My lady, I am deeply in your debt, and I will make it up to you. With your permission, I'd like to travel to the Land of the Green Isles to see you. Though we didn't really mention the Land of the Green Isles at all yet, I don't think. How did you know that, Alexander? What kind of conspiracy is this? Alright, alright. So now that we're done with the formalities, let's get on with business, shall we? Higgledy, Piggledy, Poop! Be assured that your castle is right back where it belongs. And the right size, too. But now, I think it's time that everyone return to their homes. With my help, of course. Alakazam. Alakazoo. Wait! Wait, what about Cedric? What about him? Wait, where is Cedric? Over there. Mordek turned him to stone? No, he didn't! He flippin' killed him! Stop censoring us, Nintendo! Is there anything you can do about it? Hmm, let me think. Ah, yes! I think I know! Abra... Abracabara? No, um, Abracadora? Hmm. What is that confounded word? Oh, yes. Abra... Kadabra! Crispin! Cedric, it sure is good to see you again. Likewise, I'm sure. Alright, enough is enough. Let's get on with it. I like how he speaks for all of us, the audience. Before you send us all home, Crispin, I just want to thank you for all your help. And you too, Cedric. I wouldn't be standing here without my with my I wouldn't be standing here with my family without you two. I'm deeply, deeply grateful. All in a day's work, my boy, all in a day's work. Right, Cedric! Right, Crispin! Okay, back home you go! Alakazam! Alakazoo! Alakazee! Oh, and all, we're all gone. Okay. Aw, oh, look at that. Well, there she is. Our happy home. And we're all safe and sound once more. Let's go home, shall we? Yes, let's. Where's the... Any triumphant music or anything? Come on, this is a great finale. Come on, give us a little something as he walked directly into a stump. 
Hey, max score! Woo! All right, and that must be the uh, the uh, the 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 credit scroll down there at the bottom. Oh my god! Oh whoa! Well, this game was a bit of a chore, wasn't it? I hope it wasn't as much of a chore as it was to play. Well, that was it. That was King's Quest on the Nintendo Entertainment System, and I can't do anything with my mouse outside of here. I do feel satisfied that I got a 260 out of 260, which lets me know that I remembered the game better than I thought I did. The only place where I really had to struggle was in those flipping catacombs and, Mor and uh, Mordax kind of buggy showing up whenever the hell he wants to uh, programming. Oh, but I'm glad that's over. I, can I feel like I can finally close this chapter on my life. And I think you all can too. But we'll be back with more King's Quest stuff. You know we got a lot more to cover. Yeah, we got a lot more to cover. But until that time comes, thank you for joining me. This has been King's Quest on the Nintendo Entertainment System. And as always, good night, Jelly Beans. Good night. All right, Baba. Let's do this. Baba, 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 Bibby, Yiggy. Haba, Haba. Hibby, Hibby, Hibby. Rubber Ribbies? Ribbit, 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 ribbit vessel. I don't know, I'm sorry, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Baba, there she is.